Oh. It's a gift from Grandfather. Hey. Christmas, Fred? Mm-hmm. Uh, something wrong, Freddy? Our house burned down. Everything we own is gone. What? what? This morning, a three-alarm blaze. Our house burned right down to the ground. It was real scary. I was still in my bathrobe and PJs when the fire started. The Red Cross gave me these clothes to wear. <laughs> How awful, Freddy. Well, are your mom and dad all right? Yeah, we took a room at the Pan Sleep Motel. We're gonna stay there until we find somewhere else to live. So, you're spending Christmas Eve in a motel with no Christmas tree or presents or anything? Well, a motel is no place to spend Christmas. You and your folks are gonna come over here and spend it with us. Really? You betcha. <laughs> Well, I'll go call your folks. <laughs> Fred, Fred. How'd the fire get started, Freddy? Well, you know the song that goes, chestnuts roasting on an open fire, yeah. right? Well, my dad tried roasting some chestnuts on an open fire. And all of a sudden, a chestnut exploded. And the next thing we knew, we were watching our house burn down as Jack Foss was limping out our nose. <laughs> There we go. I'll get it. That must be my folks. That might be my mom. Yo, oh. <laughs> <The old> sport. <laughs> Mr. and Mrs. Lippincottman, we're glad you could be with us. Thank you so much for asking us. Yeah, it goes for me, too. <laughs> you know, uh, I sort of creamed your mailbox. <laughs> You ought to put uh, day glow house numbers on your new one. It's the only smart thing to do. That's what we have on ours. Had. Uh, may I take your coats? <laughs> Depends on where you're going to take them. <laughs> har, har. <laughs> Thank you, Richard. Are you watching this, Frederick? Yes, Mom. <laughs> I guess the Red Cross just gave you any old thing to wear. These are mine. 